But a king? Throughout the offseason, it was clear that the Habs needed to add a top, six player to their lineup. Kent Hughes had already mentioned on several occasions that he wanted to add goals and size to his team, which of course ignited the rumors. Habs fans were eagerly awaiting the outcome of this matter, which ultimately turned out to be the Patrick Lane transaction. However, prior to this transaction, many were beginning to doubt, or had even given up hope, that the Canadiens' general manager would add a top-notch forward to his team. The clock was ticking, and the rumors were fading. Well, this long wait would in the offseason. It became clear that the Montreal Canadiens were on the hunt for a top-six forward to boost their offense. General manager Kent Hughes had hinted multiple times about adding both size and scoring ability, leading to a wave of rumors and fan anticipation. After much speculation, the Canadians made a splash by acquiring Patrick Lane from the Columbus Blue Jackets, but not before fans started to lose hope. The long delay in making a deal stemmed from the fact that Hughes had multiple serious options on the table. According to reports, the Canadians were close to landing other key players, including Trevor Zegras of the Anaheim Ducks. Zegras was a name that had been linked to Montreal for over a year, but according to Elliot Friedman, that possibility is now officially off the table. Friedman explained that while the Canadians explored the Zegras option, the price for the young star was likely much higher than for Lane, making Lane the more viable acquisition. At 23 years old, Zegras is three years younger than Lane and does not come with the same hefty contract. However, the cost to bring him to Montreal likely would have been steep, probably more than just sending Jordan Harris to Anaheim. With Lane now in Montreal, Hughes' pursuit of Zegras seems to have come to an end, and it appears Zegras will remain with the Ducks for the upcoming season. Friedman also touched on the Ducks' leadership situation, mentioning Radko Gudas as a strong candidate to become their next captain, which further indicates that Anaheim is focused on developing their young core with veteran guidance. While the Canadians' quest for a top-six forward has now been fulfilled with Lane, the Zegras' rumors can officially be put to rest, and the focus shifts to seeing how Lane integrates into Montreal's lineup as they aim to be more competitive this season. Go Habs, go!